They say that actions speak louder than words, but as far as hand gestures go, a simple action can also be more confusing than words. 86% of communication lies in body language and hands are considered an important part of nonverbal communication. Thumb in the forefinger. It may mean two in the low countries, but flash this in China and people assume you're saying eight. But avoid flashing it around in Italy as it means not good. The thumbs up. What means all right or good in the UK, the United States, and South Africa carries a different meaning in Afghanistan, Iran, and Iraq. If your travels ever bring you to those parts of the world, remember that the thumbs up is considered a vulgar insult. The OK sign. In most culture, it means OK, but in some others, it has a very different meaning. In Venezuela and Turkey, for example, it means homosexual. The Brazilians see it as a vulgar insult, while in Germany, it can either mean OK or an insult depending on which part of the country you're in. The fingers brought together. Most commonly seen in Italy as a gesture that asks, what's this? But in other culture, it has various meanings such as little in India and Congo, beautiful in Turkey, and wait a moment in Egypt. Come here or go away. Another example of how a gesture can have one meaning in one culture and the direct opposite meaning in another. In the Czech Republic, Denmark, and the Netherlands, doing this means you're asking someone to go away. But in Ghana, Philippines, and Vietnam, it means you're asking someone to come to you.